Mob Psycho 100 has got to be one of my favorite anime that I've seen yet. The end of last season was insane. This season is hopefully going to be even more insane. We're getting ready for season three. So if you've been watching with me on YouTube all the way to this point, I know you're excited. Thanks for sticking around. If you want to watch future episodes of season two right now, check out the Patreon down below. Or you become a YouTube member by hitting the join button. Watch the edited version early. I remember how the last season started. You remember episode one? Wait, is this season two? This is the same opening for season episode one, season two. Is this episode... Season one? I think the, the first episode of season one actually started a similar way. Imagine they just threw Reagan up there with those who fought like some of the greatest. <laughs> I, that would have been so funny. You okay, bro? I saw an apple. Oh, a big black dark thing. It's like a locust infestation or something, like bugs, maybe? Surely it's just bugs and not a spirit, right? Is this gonna be Reagan in his room? <laughs> well, you called the best. You called the best in the industry. Yeah, you know what I've been through. It's kind of pricey. Dude's so broke that he doesn't even have appropriate sockware. What are some of these prices? I don't think we've looked at them before. 2,000 yen, 5,000 yen, or 12,000 for an all-out course. And Mob gets this much of it. <laughs> He's gonna reap the food. What was it? Sorry, what was that? He was after a mushroom at the end of the last season. That's what it was. They got that mushroom, right? They like, they like grilled it. He's a man of the culinary arts. There he is, my boy. <laughs> New season, same Reagan. Uh oh. It's not your average scarecrow. It's a real scarecrow. <laughs> Activate Beyblade mode. Oh. That was it. That was pretty good. Not bad. Oh, oh, wait. It's actually under the ground. It's just like the Warhammer Titan, except kind of in reverse. <laughs> Is this straw hat this supposed to be like a reference to Luffy or something? Regal Regal has the worst name for a, a villain spirit ever. That's gonna ruin the fields, ripping up like that. It's not like a cyborg. Absorb life force of all the crops. So he's just a gluttonous spirit. <laughs> Let's go. I've missed this show so much, man. Dude, the music, the animation, just like the, the, the swiftness of the movements, too. It's so clean. It actually looks like Batman Scarecrow. This is the world's biggest ball of yarn. Controlling things like a remote control car. <laughs> he just thought about it and did it. That's mob for you, bro. Another day of work for the great Reagan. Controlling them by sending them a stronger signal. Oh. This is the mob becomes a coder arc. Sheesh. That's actually insane of like for power scaling wise. Him being able to control environment with his powers now. <laughs> nice. Bone smack the teeth, am I right? <laughs> We're really looking for that savings. <laughs> he said, grow yourself. Is that a bag of hummus? You're kidding me, right? This power of scale, then I get broccoli. That's a good point. Now if he can change environment stuff. He can just... Mom's a god. He's actually an, a literal god. He can create life around him. That's even getting deeper. Could he create life from nothing with this? Well, it didn't really taste great. It's a start. Psycho helmet religion? <laughs> Search for our beloved founder. Have we, oh, hold on, have we seen her since that episode? Was she a part of the last couple episodes, like investigation wise? I can't remember quite exactly where she's, if she's from the same school, but I think so. We're starting a cult, okay, got it. Well, sign me up. He can grow, he can grow tomatoes now. <laughs> <laughs> the armor on his hands. That, wait, that's actually Saitama. Wait, it's actually Saitama's cape. That's Saitama's exact cape with like a more of a samurai like suit. That was a cool little catch. Yeah, it's right, because he changed his life around. And he actually is not so pale anymore. Repenting of his sins and looking better, getting some sunlight. I really kind of respect that for standing down. <laughs> Dude, if Ma becomes class president. Oh, she's got something on the mind. Subomi, I was just gonna say she's gonna use Subomi. Subomi-chan. Subomi 
All the other girls are eggplants in comparison to her. What do you mean? What, 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 what makes you think that? I feel like Mob has more emotion this season already. Been friends? Can he even talk to her, really? I guess maybe they were friends before, and then they got to school, and she just kind of went on a different path of popularity. Student council, you'll be popular enough. Get Subomi, get the bag. These little armbands feel so, like, dictator-ish. should rethink the drip for, uh, school, school council. You'll owe me? You're gonna have to lead a cult. <laughs> Hardcore training montage. They mob got some cheeks this season, too. Would you guys vote for mob? Be honest with me. I would put at least one vote in for mob. He's rerunning again? Maybe to run and get elected in the right way? I'm back, hoes. His opportunity to make things right, yeah. I don't know. I mean, like, I feel like the people would vote for him. They've been led under him before. I act like this is a country or something. It's literally school. Okay, everybody, get ready. Fingers crossed this goes well. My boys! They're cheering for me! Whitey poison! He's gonna do... He's gonna say something really unhinged. He's gonna say something weird. God, he didn't say anything at all. <laughs> he didn't say a word for five minutes. Oh no! I will never be a cult leader. Dang, my man. At least he got the courage to do it. I love how the the bodybuilding club is looking out for my man. He's actually got some friends now. You know the other Espers, Ritsu. <gasps> it's probably just. It's pro. It's probably not Subomi. Really? <laughs> Mom about the bus. He's at 21. He's got a new secret admirer. He's got a new love interest. He probably feels so happy to see him get a girl. <laughs> this artwork is so well done, man. You gotta give props to the animation studio, the manga cut who wrote this. I've never been on like a gondola or one of those things. Do these things exist? Do people ride in, in animals like that? I feel like she's baiting him in some way. I don't trust this hoe. I mean, respectable girl. It's a bookstore, but my I don't get paid anything but broccoli. Mob, what is happening this season, my man? Straight up lying. I feel like before he wouldn't have had the social awareness to lie. Does anybody agree? Emmy, that's her name. She's writing a novel. Oh. Wait, what do you mean? He just he just said that's a. Woman? He, no, you said the right thing! I wanna cry. He's so repentant. He's so repentant. Every day after that, he walked home with this girl. <laughs> Dimples just living in my house still, man. Huh? Oh, God. <laughs> His confidence kind of boosted a little bit. So <laughs> I'm heading home. This is so weird. Like, this, this change of, like... I don't know. There's all these events happening to him. You know a lot of big words. Good one, mom. Men get attacked too much. My boy, mom, deserves none of this. He just said, you use a lot of big words. You're pretty smart. And she's like, you can say if you're stupid. Exercise her. It's over. She's not the one for you. Did he like, he didn't say no. What? He's been so clear. Like a little too overly clear in my eyes. It's straight to the point. Exercise her, bro. She's not worth it. She ain't hey, nobody. Nobody needs her. Bro, it was all off of a dare. This poor guy. It felt so real. The juice they shared. The running into trees he did. The peeing his pants. That also happened. There was love there developing. Dang, man. She's so, like, cringy the way she's acting with them, too. They're also cringe. <gasps> you know what to do, Mom. Show her you really can have her. That's the real crime. Dang, her whole novel. He's still standing up for her. 
I want to see if y'all can do better. Y'all get up on the podium. Yeah, a lot of talk for someone who ain't done it. He's so nice. She is obviously very easily peer pressured by these people. Doesn't want to go up against them. He's picking them up one by one. <laughs> so pure, he's crying. He's crying. She having a change of heart too? But why y'all look like Squidward though? They all look like Squidward. This music is so good, dude. It's gonna blow away. Mom's gonna stop it with his powers. <gasps> dude. Bro. Dude, you better husband up this bro right now. I mean, not yet. You're too young, but it's one day. That's a, that's a real man right there. <laughs> How's she gonna respond to that one? It's about me just sitting at the end there. She what? She saw it. She saw it. It's smooth. I mean, even without his psychic powers, he did win her over. She's not as bad as I made her out to be. I can kind of see her angle now. Definitely felt malicious at first, but now it feels a lot more peer pressure-y. The, the thing that's so good about this season, other than the great Reagan, is the fact that his social awareness level is also, like, ticking up, along with his explosion, right? It's like his emotional capacity to feel the right things, to process everything that's happening to him, to allow himself to cry, to put himself out there and get to know a girl. You know, that's the best thing of season two, episode one. I feel like this show does the psychology of a character so well, and that's what I really like. I would definitely be Mob's friend too, for sure. He's such a nice guy. Great season two, episode one. Thanks for watching with me over on YouTube. If you want to watch the rest of season two right now, early in a cut, check out the Patreon down below. Overcome a YouTube member. Watch the edited versions early as well. Drop us a sub like, you know, subscribe, a like, and a comment. I'll see you in the next reaction video.